How are y'all doing? My name is Lionel Ray Roger Contreras. Today we're going to teach you how to change your oil. Let's get started. First things first, you got to have the right tools. What we got here is the basic of the basic. Anything you'll find in your little nephew's toolkit. Sample stuff. Next thing that you're going to need if you don't have a jack, get yourself a pair of ramps. These bad boys right here held up two show peaks in the back of my Tacoma back in 86 for a show we did. And last but not least, you're going to need your oil your filter and your funnel. Now you're probably wondering why so much oil? It's a good question I'm glad you asked. The reason why you need so much oil? If you done never done seen 426 horses under the hood then bad boys gotta stay lubricated. Let's go ahead and get her started up. As you can see here, I lined up the ramps right next to the tires. That way it hops right on it like a whore at a whorehouse. Now we just gotta drive it up nice and slowly. And one thing I wanted to point out real quick is my custom license plate I got. D-A-L-R stands for Don't Lose Ray Roger. My legal name is Leah Nail, but Ray Roger is what I go by. It's my middle name. Parents gave it to me. Back to the D-A-L-R, Don't Lose Roger. I tell myself that every time when I'm racing these Honda Civics and Nissan Infinities G35s, because can't lose. People say, well, why don't you race something faster? It sounds like an easy win. Well, like my Uncle Billy Ben Bob once told me, with great power comes wide open throttles. And with wide open throttles, comes great responsibility. All right, y'all, now let's get down to the dirty. Get ourselves under this vehicle. Oh. All right, feels just like home. I gotta be sure to use the spark plug attachment to your monkey wrench, because you're gonna remove this here spark plug right there. All right, now before you remove the spark plug, make sure that you got yourselves an oil pan right next to you. Honestly, it could be an oven pan, a cooking pan, but oil pan is. Of course, I know some are asking, why is there a spark plug in the oil drain? Well, with this upgrade that I've done to this here engine, it's called a in addition combustion that I added. If you ignite the oil in addition to the gas going through the engine, adds about 20 horsepower. Once you break it loose, just use your fingers and you can twist it off real simple like that. It'll just come right off and the oil will come pouring right down. Ah, smells like smoked Honda Civics and 370s. Yeah, it's that good stuff. Looks like I done your underestimated the amount of oil that this baby's gonna pour out. So I went out and got the big guns. All right, now once you finish with that, you gotta screw the spark plug back in, make sure it's tight. We're gonna move on now to this year here, which is the nitrous tank. Now it is crucial that you replace the nitrous tank every oil change, so that way the oil and the nitrous get a good mixture and you don't get any hiccups when you're racing. Now a lot of people really need a really strong tool to remove this because it's on tight. I mean, you need about 300, 400 pounds of force. Well, when your name is Ray Rogers, you got this... It's easy as that. Now before you put your nitrous tank in, you got to make sure it's lubricated. Yeah, you got to get real lubricated in the inside, yeah, just like that. If this year nitrous tank is a pole and you're a stripper, it's got to be so lubricated that you'll be able to slide up and down it as if you were in a banjo twerking contest. Got to pop that sucker back on there. And you're all set. Now we can get up out from under the car. That's pretty much everything that we got to do in the undercarriage. That's what she's saying. All right, line, let's go ahead and bring it down from the ramp. Uh -huh. 
Last but not least, we got the easiest thing. We're just gonna pour the oil in the engine and we're done. There you have folks, last step to complete the oil change. So, whole oil change in total should only take you about five, 10 minutes, nothing complicated. Major key to success, knowing how to change your oil. They don't want you driving on these streets. They don't want you on the road to success.